Hey everyone, Bob Apples here, and today we're going to be going over just a quick little Gek edit. Um, we're going to be going over how to edit mods that have an ESM, um, and I'm going to sneeze. It's going to be great. <coughs> oh, thank you. So, we are doing Robco today. So, Robco has an ESM, and ESM basically means the mod author has shoved it up in a little box and put a lock on it, so we can't really edit the internal things of it but we can do some stuff so we're, what we're going to do today is we're going to um, increase the bot limit that we can have and we're also going to rename some of the bots so we click on robco esm and since there's there's an esp for this but uh it's not it's something stupid it's just like a yeah certified friendly hit fixer so we're, we don't need that so let's just hit okay and it's gonna load uh, feel free to write a book. Read a book. Um, don't burn any books. Uh, maybe get a meal. Uh, fight someone. Actually, no, don't fight anyone. Unless they're a douche. Um, not really sure what else you could do. Um, have a baby. Ooh, have a baby. Make a baby. Ugh. Eh. Well, I don't know. All right, and it finally loaded. Holy bajangles. So the first thing um, is we're, we want to figure out where we want to put our bots. Um, usually, uh, it's a good place. I usually enjoy Boulder City. So I've gone to World Space, I set it to Wasteland New Vegas, so we're not only in Inside Things. Go to Boulder City, double clicky wikis. It's going to come up, whoop up. I'm going to double click somewhere else. Uh, just double click on any of these, it'll bring you down. Um, I'm expecting you guys to know at least a, a small amount of Gek. This isn't a beginner series, so if you don't know how to get around the Gek, then go look at some videos about how to do that. So, uh, we're in Boulder City, and what um, I want to do first is I'm going to hit the, uh, I'm going to go to File, Save, and now we can create um, um, a mod that will leech off of Robco Robots, because since we turned on that ESM, if we go up here, if we go to our file data, we can see that where is it? Robco certified is activated. So whatever we save, it's going to take stuff from Robco certified. So that's going to allow us to uh, basically just use the uh, stuff that's in Robco. So let's um, let's not get confused. So let's name this Robco Our Bots. All right. I'm just going to save. And now what we're going to do is thank God, by the way, for this. Um, the mod author has made all of his changes. You can see here. All of his changes he's made, he's listed A0A. Um, so that's a mod author nomenclature, so he can tell what he has made. So as we can see, if I type in AOA up here, it filters. And this is all the mod author stuff, so this is going to make it our jobs a thousand times easier. So what I'm going to do, um, if we want to add some of these bots, let's see we want to add some of the bots. I'm going to go look around. I'm not exactly sure where they are. It's probably under actors. We go to creature. And yeah, it looks like it's that one. Okay, so we we can uh, let's drag one of these over. It's gonna say it's a quest object. They're all listed as quest objects, so just hit yes. So let's see. This guy's a robot guy. So that's the NPC because he's a human. He's listed under NPC, um, and all the robot actual robots are gonna be listed under creature because they're creatures or they're listed. So once again, we drag over one of the creatures. We get this quest thing. Just hit yes. Don't worry about it. And, uh, yeah, so we got this Scuttlebutt guy, and we got this uh, Mr. Man. So we got Scuttlebutt and Mr. Man. Now, what, what do we want to do? First, save, because the get crashes, like, um, good God. I don't even want to think of a metaphor. So double-click on him, hit edit base, and basically what we're going to do is we're going to give him a different name. So if we do this, um, every Scuttle brain that we create is going to have this name. So, so I'm just going to do that. Later on, maybe another tutorial, we'll do uh, custom NPCs. But for now, we're just going to do a big overhaul. So we're going to go into Name and just type Scuttlebutt. And now hit OK. And if we double-click on him again, hit Edit Base. I forgot to mention that before. His name is still Scuttlebutt. So this guy is going to be named Scuttlebutt. And basically, um, if you want to edit any of this stuff, like uh, stats or AI data, uh, we don't really need to edit any of this because he's just going to follow us as soon as we start up the game. So he's good. 
Um, so when we get in the game and we activate our mod, Scuttlebutt will find us, or we'll go to Boulder City, and and then we'll uh, we'll be reunited. And this is Mr. Man, so we're gonna click him, edit base, and you might see this. All right, so it's grayed out, and you go, oh no, what's going on? What you gotta do? I actually, I'm not completely sure, but I'm just gonna test it right here. You got all these check boxes. So if something's ever grayed out, just go through all these check boxes, check them off, check them on. If you check it off, and then this turns white. Okay, so it's base data. We unchecked base data. We're going to go up to name and name this guy Mr. Man. Now, we don't need to recheck this because if we do that, it goes back to lobotomite. So just uncheck it. He's got his name. Now we can type in Mr. Man again. So just hit OK. Hit OK again. So now Scuttlebutt, that's his name still. Um, if we go to edit base, it's still there. I'm just going to do it anyhow. Scuttlebutt and Mr. Man, he's here. Um... Now, what do we want to do? What we want to do is we want to increase the perks because right now this mod only lets you have about eight bo robots. I almost said bobots. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to type A0A and we're going to go up to actor data right here. So make it bigger. We're going to go down to perky works and we can see we got a whole bunch of ones. Um, but the one we're interested is, I'm not completely sure, but this is how I do it. I just go through all these and I see which one makes sense. So this... So this one's the one we want. A zero A Rob Robco perk bonus. No matter how many robots you have, you've never gained enough. Each rank gives of this gives you two extra robots. Okay, so you would think this kind of looks like oh, if we make this thirty, it would make you know we get more bots. But no, what we got to do is this perk. I think perks are linked to quests. I'm not exactly sure, but for this one it is. So we have to find A zero A junk quest and edit data there. So right now we're going to go to A0A, and we're just going to type in Junk Quest. Now nothing's going to pop up because we're under Perks. So scroll down, go to All, and here it is, A0A Junk Quest. And we got some information, blah, blah, blah. But here's, the, here's what we're looking for. So Quest Stages, click on the 10, and then we, this is code. This is like really um, simple, easy code. So it says Set Robot. Robco limit bonus to Robco limit bonus plus two. So let's go crazy. Let's just make it plus 40. And we can do this for 10. We can do this for number for the first rank. What these indicate are ranks. So the first rank of the perk gives us plus 40 bots. Second rank of the perk will give us plus 40 bots. And then the third rank will give us plus 40 bots. And then there's no fourth rank, or I guess there is, but there's other stupid stuff that we're not looking at right now. So I'm just going to go on ahead and hit OK, and we're going to save, and we're going to bring up Fallout. So bring up your um, your uh, Fallout Mod Manager. You got your Robco certified right here. Scroll all the way down, and this is my previous Robco robots. So I'm going to uncheck this, and I'm going to do Robco Our Bots. And you can see, see Robco certified is um is the parent mod. So our mod, Robco Our Bots, is going to take the information that we made and it's going to use the models and stuff. It's not really that important, but um, I guess it is important, isn't it? Whatever. All right, so I'm going to, let's uh, just give me a second. All right, so I just started New Vegas. I clicked Launch NVSE. You guys should be able to know that. I mean, if you're editing a damn mod, you should know how to turn them on. Um, all right, so... We're loading up our game. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna choose um, I'm gonna choose a save game I have that doesn't involve um, us. Actually, let's go to Good Springs. Yeah. Okay. Screw it. All right. So we're loading Good Springs. I'm unzipping my shirt. It's uh, amazing. And um, I'm gonna show you how if you didn't have any of the perks enabled, how we can get that. Um, which you, you probably wouldn't want to do this, though, because this is going to mess up your level cap. If you do what I'm about to do, your level cap won't increase anymore. All right, so we got our friendly Wendy's here, the usual crew. Um, uh, and we got some stupid other thing. That's for a different mod. So I'm just going to go. I'm going to look up at the sky so you can kind of see. Actually, I'm going to go over here. So we see hit my console command. I'm going to hit player.adv level. And I'm going to put, it doesn't matter what you put up, so I'm just going to do sneak. And then we got, <clears throat> we're going to look for our thingy. Um, let's see, we could do, um, let me look for Robco certified. Do that one. 
and I'm just going to type it in again, player.adv advanced. Put this up to something. And now we should have the ability, here we go, robot wrangler. So it's still going to have the same text because we didn't edit, edit the text. We only edited the code. So it says it still says 2, but it's supposed it's going to be 40. So I'm going to hit A. And now let's go to Boulder Springs and pick up our buddies. This is the part of the, the video where I don't know where Boulder Springs is. It's great. There it is. Do do do. Now when we when we get there, um, the game should say it should be like the two bots that we made should come up to us and it might say two of 40 bots or it might not. It's probably not going to say that. Oh, there we go. It says robot cap 3 of 45. So we know that our um, our code worked. And here we are. We got Mr. Man following us and Scuttlebutt. So it has been successful. And um, hope this hope this has helped you guys. Um, for If you want to edit other mods, it's basically the same stuff. Um, I will be doing some other tuts about... <laughs> tuts, that's a funny word. About um, just creating your own custom NPCs really quick and easy. Nothing... Nothing fancy like with a companion wheel or anything, but hope you guys have enjoyed this. Um, let me know what you think, and I'll see you in the future. Celebration, shoot the gun in the air. Oh.